Hi guys, Kelly here, and I am doing a review on this Winky Lux Mermaid Kitten Palette. The packaging is absolutely adorable. I might uh, save it and maybe put it in one of my Barbie rooms or something. Who knows? Anyways, uh, I did wear this the other day. Um, here's the back. Nothing, nothing in particular. Uh, sides, you know, all the good stuff. It is cruelty free. Anyways, most makeup is now these days. I mean, you know, that's just that. But the packaging matches the box and it's just absolutely adorable. I can't say enough good things about it, about how adorable it is. By the way, do you guys like my hair? I think I haven't brushed it in like two days, so it's kind of, you know, out there. Anyway, so you open it up, and bam, there it is. There's the mess that you guys can see. So this one right here is called Topless, and it is a... It's a deeper champagne color. So, and then there's the picture of my daddy right there. That's nice. This one is called Sea Foam. Now, this is kind of this is a, a glitter, and I didn't realize it was so glittery because when in the palette it doesn't look glittery, but when I put it all over my eyes, I could definitely see the glitter, and it kind of bothered me a little bit. Um, this one is called Sand Dollar, and it's not a matte. I think it's a shimmer. Yeah, it says it can double as a topper, so I didn't use it because it was it looked a little too shimmery to me, so I didn't use it. And then this one right here is called Pink Sands. Um, it is a nice matte color. It would be used well for a transition shade or just, you know, if you want to use, you know, for whatever. Uh, the next one is called Ursula, which is a deep plum or eggplant color, and it is a shimmer, re shimmery, yeah, and topless is shimmery too, I don't know if you guys can see that or not, um, and then we have Under the Sea, Under the Sea, and that's a really pretty uh, dark blue, I would have a hard time wearing it as a shimmer just because it's so dark. And then we have Siren right here, which is, it's actually very pretty. I, this is the one that I wore these two shades, and I put this one underneath my eye line to smoke it out, and then I use this one on top to, on my brow bone. That's why there's green in it. <laughs> uh, so, and then we have Seaweed, which is a really dark green matte, and then the last one is Treasure. Um, let me just show you sea foam, and it literally is just basically kind of like a highlighter. You can't even really see. It's not, my camera really isn't doing it justice. It's kind of unis unicorn skinny, iridescent, so my camera just isn't really doing it justice, even in the light. Like, yeah. So, um... Let's try this blue, and this purple, and this topless color. So, here they all are. And right next to each other. Not too much of a... Of, definitely get metallic payoff. Um, this roll, It's actually a rose gold, and it's really pretty. Again, the camera isn't just doing it, it justice. So, they look kind of matte, but they really aren't. They're really nice and shimmery. And I will enjoy this palette for many, many, many days, times. Anyways, I just wanted to show you this. Uh, I found this at Target for $25. Uh, $25 is kind of expensive in my book for nine shades. But... Um, because you all can do the math. That's, I don't even know how many shades that, that's how much it is. 
There was others there, but this is, was my favorite by far. Uh, I like the color story more. I would recommend this if you want to pay $25 for Nine Shades. Um, I do not. So, um, I probably will not purchase again unless I find a color story that I really, really like and have yet to, um, have tried. Uh, so I have, hadn't tried Winky Lux before and they are nice and smooth. They're creamy. They blend well. You know, for $25, they should do my, my, my damn laundry, but, you know. Um, and the one thing I like about Target is that they're, while you can open the box and look, open it up and look at it, you can't, like, get in there and touch it. So, you know, if you happen to be in a place that is sick, has, has the virus, has the vids, then I would, um, I would say that it would be safe to buy it from Target as long as, you know, you practice the safe precautions of washing your hands, not touching your face, wearing a mask, uh, don't wear gloves because they're kind of useless, um, but that's, that's really up to you, y'all do you, I mean, I've seen people do things like wear sponges on their face and, uh, tie tennis shoes to their face cover themselves basically from head to toe in garbage bags. Uh, you do whatever makes you feel safe. Um, but this is what, this, this is a good thing. I enjoyed it. I will enjoy it again. And, um, the fact that it has mermaid kittens all over it definitely made my day. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. And, um, I want you to be you, stay strong, and be beautiful. Bye, guys!